Have you ever had a day where you really wanted to drag your nuts across a cheese crater just to feel something, just to get rid of that emotional vacuum that is inside you right now? You are staring into the void, the void is staring back, and you feel only kinship. Or something like that. Uh, not me, <laughs> that's for sure. Today we're using a quality build, and we're using the Banished Knight Quality Greatsword. It's a fun little weapon that goes like pow, pow, pow. A really fun technique that you can use is first, trade with them, charge up the heavy attack, but only halfway, and get the roll catch. You won't always get it, because it's a little down to how good the connection is, but it's always very satisfying if you do. Our talismans are the Shadow of Alexander, because I like using Ashes of War, Axe Talisman, because I like charging stuff, the Bulgo Talisman, because poise, and the Earth Tree's favor because I could not really think of a different thing to use. I'm having Impaling Thrust as my Ash of War, simply because that's fun to use, and currently I'm level 200. I don't know if I said that. Level 200, 71 strength, 71 dex. I also have a few incantations, simply because it adds flavor. Well, enjoy the invasions! Everyone. Hi, gents. I have come for cookies this time. No violence, just cookies. Do you have some cookies? I would like to see if you have some cookies. I want to see if you have cookies in your back pocket. Now, granted, since you're not giving me any cookies, I'm going to have to chop off your torso and check your back pockets that way. That sounds a little like overkill, but hey, a girl's got to have a hobby, right? Oh, I can be careful. Look at that. Oh, boy. Didn't go far. Backstab? No. Just a little bit of a front slice, maybe? That's the best way of putting it. I also have some uh, uplifting aromatics. Since none of these guys are using any kind of projectile, I'm very happy about uh, th this current situation. Oh, that was a bad idea. I'm sorry, man, but you shouldn't have done that. Although, I don't need to tell him, do I? My wife says that I explain things too much, you know, too many times. And I'm sure that he understands that dying is bad, especially while he is in the process of dying. I'm sure there is some kind of pain circulating through his nervous system that would indicate that what he is experiencing is not what it uh, should be. Still. I'm, I'm all for killing orphans, though, because, you know, orphans are sad. Orphans orphans are terrible. Everybody everybody says that we need to love the orphans, right? They do, but listen to my logic. If orphans are so great, why don't they have parents? Checkmate! Webster. I don't think I have ever talked with anybody whose name is Webster. That sounds like a a teen name, but a teen in the 90s, you know, that, that sounds like a Webster to me. Somebody that would be pushing 50 at this point. Not to say that it's a bad name, it's just a little mm, baby, a little old fashioned. Are you going to heal? No, then I'm not going to heal either. I'm going to be... Good on this. Ooh, okay. That's pretty good. And we have the other red coming in. Could ruin it for the both of us. Yeah, there it is. There it is. But he's just focusing on the other guy. Oh! <gasps> Holy hell! No! 
feeling that should have hit. I felt like that was a good plan, and that was a terrible plan. That was a terrible plan! Still, that was a really good fight. Floppage. That is a great word. I'm not entirely certain in what context it needs to be used, but I do know it needs to be used. Floppage. When you're just sick of everything and face plant on purpose onto the ground. Oh boy, that seems like proper floppage to me. Okay, that's 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 pretty good. Uh, we did manage to get him. Uh, we can heal up as well. That's lovely. Now go away, please, and we'll drink this too. Now that we have a little bit of an opportunity. Oh! <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! Nice. Very nice. This is a fun place to fight. I haven't fought here in a while. I like the view. Oh boy. Hey there, bud. I just assumed that all of these guys were already in a fight. Because I was, uh... I was zoned out a bit. I was thinking about something. I was thinking about Giffles. Giffles is a, like, small cinnamon bun that you can buy at the store. It's really good if you have a little bit of chocolate next to it. It's my favorite snack. Those guys are doing fine. Oh, thank God. I uh, couldn't see you guys on the map, but I assume that I would find you guys over here. It is a very natural place to get together and uh, commence with some violence. You guys did seem like you were waiting for me, though. And here... Oh, well, that was fun. Fantastic. Oh, that's also fantastic. So... Yeah. Now we need to get a little bit more people involved. Now, I can't get any reds involved, unfortunately, because, you know... Hey, bud. Nice hit by me. If I eat a little bit of juice... Oh? What the hell? What happened there? I... I, I don't know. Look, I got hit, like, twice really hard, and I decided... Maybe I should just kill him when I have the chance. Maybe his controller died or something? Maybe he decided, ah, he's not gonna hit me, I'll just switch up my character or my outfit or my arm. I don't know. That was weird. Oof, that looks like it would be painful. Ah, oh, damn it. If only I had gotten that back. Okay. Nice hit. Oh! I had him, and then he had me. Ayasaroth. That's what I assume your name is. Ooh, nice. No oh boy, everybody hits me at the same time. There, wait, that guy's a red. He just made a mistake. We can forgive the man. He made a mistake. It's okay. Ooh, there we go. He actually killed that guy fairly easily. Oh, what is his build? He has a buckler! Wow, I haven't seen that. Then again, he, he's using the buckler prop mostly as a... Mostly as a uh, fashion thing. Because he's not using the buckler parry. And why would he, really? Nobody uses the buckler parry. GG, Mozzarella Lord. Hi, Rick. I'm sorry, it took me a little while, but I... I spawned far away. Have a boulder. In the face. Okay, we, we're gonna do the honorable thing then. That's fine. Uh, you wanna heal up? 
All right, he does not want to heal up, which is fine, I suppose. Maybe when we start actually doing some real damage. Gotta say, though, I respect the man for only using one spear. And yeah, there it, there it is. We are, in fact... Nope. Oh, that's unfortunate. Ooh, come on. Use your Ash of War. Good hit there, as I unfortunately jumped before I saw that coming. GG, Rick. GG. Big body Bess. She doesn't look that big bodied. Still, I'm not going to complain too much. The big ladies needs love too. Oh boy. Need to be a little careful here, cause that blob thing, ooh, that can that can that can be trouble. That's that oh come on, come on. Stay away from everything. He said and then jump back and forth, back and forth into everything. Ooh, big body best don't have a lot of health. And I decided to end it there, because uh, I couldn't get a good hit in on the Phantom. The connection was a little awful, so I think that was the best I could do in that situation. Magna. It seems like uh, Magna over there is uh, using the classic Dark Souls 3 build. It is a dangerous one. You ready? Yes, let's go. You have a halberd and a... Uh, Fun little pokey stick. Because the pokey stick is quick and the halberd has reach, and especially with that. Ooh, that didn't hit at all. That's, that's a little sad. Ooh, that was excellent. Oh, come on. What? Ooh. That was damn close! Holy hell. Still, a very good fight. You can see why that build was so dangerous back in the day. And still is, actually. Azor. Was there also an aloe card here? I saw something when I popped in. At any rate. Hi, friendo. You and me? Nice. Didn't hit that. Ooh. That was easy enough. GG. I should bow. There we go. Gabbly Gurker. I've been here before. I know what these boys do. I know what the plan is. Although there's a hunter here. And Australia's! I have met him before too. The G Gabbly Gurker has a tendency to try to knock you off the ledge using the dragon spell. So, let's see what happens here then. I'm gonna go with the beast claw, see if that can do some stuff. So he's over here then, huh? Oh yeah, go for it. Seems smart to me. Oh no, he's using the finger! Well, he might use both things. The finger might just be a sneaky little... Oh ho ho! No, he's, he is, in fact, using the finger. Oh, boy. You know what? That had a lot of potential. Could have gone plenty of ways. Thank you. Thank you so much for the vengeance. What are you, what are you doing? <laughs> what was that? <laughs> Why are you attacking the wall? Oh, that hurt. That hurt a lot. Ooh, baby! I'll freely admit that I did not expect to win that. I expected to get blended instead. I was the blender, and they was the blenderese. That is a perfectly reasonable statement, by the way. Sentence. Sentence! Ooh, hey there, buddy! Are you okay? You should be careful when you, uh... When you go to... Ooh, places like this, because, you know... 
You can fall down and you can you can break like legs and uh, and stuff. Yeah. Oh, okay. I will probably go around th this side. Nicely done, me. Less nicely done, me. Ooh, very well done, me. One more. Yes! Just gotta escape. I am currently stuck. There we go. Uh, that could have been real bad. Oh, that's so good. Oh my god, that... It's, it's a pseudo combo, alright? But it's still so much fun to pull off. <laughs> Pseudo combo is strong. Uh, panic roll. There you go. GG, my friend. Very G. Hi, Belmont. You do indeed look a bit like a Belmont, do you? You have that. Uh... Ooh. <laughs> Tried to be sneaky. You have the wisps. Wisps. Whips. Whip. I, I don't know. I don't know why I struggle to talk here today. But I do. I, I struggle. And the man is dead. And then there's another man behind me. And I'm okay with that. I, uh, I've, I've had plenty of men behind me, if you know what I mean. I'm gonna let that... Uh, I'm just gonna let that linger in the air. Hey, puppy! Oh, okay. That... That was a little weird, but I'm just going to assume that because of our mutual friend disappearing, the connection got a little iffy. Well, I say mutual friend. I did murder him, but I've, I've killed some of my friends. I killed a lot of friends. I feel like they become my friends, part of the family when I kill them. Now, does that mean that I have some kind of psychosis? Does that mean that I might be some kind of serial killer? Well, maybe, but even so... A man should take pride in his work, and uh, I also am very socially uh, socially inept, and I struggle to make friends. So uh, I'm gonna need some assistance from you and all of your dead companions. Now we can now we can be together forever. No hairline. Well. I'm curious to see if this man is speaking the truth. Or if he's lying to me. Hi! Hmm. Ooh. I can't... Oh, what happened? What was that? That's a bloody finger! I mean, that was a very short invasion, but I, I feel like... I feel like I should save that, because that was kind of funny.